Hey YouTube, this is Eric doing a my third review on um, the Botcon Sunicons. This is um, Dead End. Very, very depressed guy. Um, writes poetry. He's like a beatnik, all that kind of stuff. Um, you know, that's just his characterization. He's based on jazz. Um, I like the colors. Does a uh, you know pretty good job of differentiating them from jazz with these colors. Um, here's jazz actually right here and um you know they, they kind of look the same you know of course they are the same car but i actually prefer the these colors more to this one you know i've never been a jazz fan anyway you know i kind of got it because i like the bot mode and the car mode but i think this this the, the color scheme for this car mode looks a lot better with the um the burgundy maroon and the little stripe that goes all the way around this way i mean it looks you know looks good I like it. You know, not that much. It's a minimalist approach. Um, not that much detail, but just enough to beat out this guy. So let me get him out of the way. Okie dokie. Let's get started with the transformation. Um, never been too good at transforming this guy. So let's see what I do here. Okay. Maybe that one, you're not supposed to pull it like that, but uh, yeah, there we go. All right. So. Um, next, I think, yeah. Pull out the legs. And the joints are really, really tight on this guy. Okay, I know his feet are back here. A lot of these animated figures I haven't transformed in so long because... You know, I, I usually like to keep my animated figures in bot mode because, I mean, bot modes are really, really, really good. Um, turn this around. And then turn that. Because this is supposed to be his nunchucks, but in his bio, it says he has, like, bazookas or something. And, um, not really sure if they're referring to this as bazookas or not, but apparently that's what, and this is tight, that's what they're supposed to be. Um, there we go, and that's about it for breakdown. Um, mine looks like he's looking down. Oh, and there goes his head. Let's put that back on. All right, maybe he's not looking down. Um, but yeah, there, here he is. And that was my phone just beeped. I got a text message, but here he is. Uh, this was the first guy, the first. Stunicon revealed as the anime Stunicons and you see his head he has a mustache and a little goatee which uh you know usually I think it's cheesy because I really you know I thought it was cheesy on um what's his name Retgar and yeah you know I think it looks good on him especially with his personality um you know the depressed beatnik guy is like a hipster and he writes poetry he, uh, I don't think he likes too much being in the Autobot protoform body, but he looks like, you know, you'd see him in a club sipping on coffee, hitting the little boop, 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 drums, reading poetry and stuff. So it looks good. I mean, it, it fits the character exactly. I mean, this looks more like Dead End than Jazz to me, honestly. Um, and I can see why they didn't even bother to give him a new head sculpt because he looks so much different from Jazz that you really don't need one. Um, actually, let me, and it, you know, see, these are his nunchucks. He holds them the same way as Jazz. Or, um, I guess you can keep it like this and make them bazookas. I, I don't know. I don't know how they're supposed to go with bazookas. Um, but let me, let me get Jazz just out for, uh, comparison's sake. So here he is with, uh, Jazz. Oh, don't knock him down. All right, so there he is with Jazz. Um, as you can see, the colors, again, do a great job of differentiating the two. And not only that, but you can see what I'm talking about. Here's Jazz. With. Let's see if we can sneak him on in there. There they go. All right, Jazz and Dead End. Let's see. If, come on, clear up camera. Pick it up. Pick it up. There you go. So you can see um the mustache and little fake goatee does a very good job of differentiating the two. Um, you know, and I, I like the Jazz mold. Let me get Jazz standing up again. I like the Jazz mold, but um. Honestly, digging it better on uh, Dead End. So, Dead End is a really, really solid, solid figure, in my opinion. Um, you know, I, I would even consider getting him as a standalone figure, maybe. Um, but again, 
you kind of need the whole set. It's like an all or nothing deal. So he looks good. My third favorite. Um, so yeah, there we go. Um, I'll move right on, uh, you know, to the next one. You'll see who my uh, second favorite is. All right, peace.